Thanks for watching KKL News at 8. KKL News at 9 starts right now. This is KCAL News, Los Angeles. Now at 9, a teenager found after disappearing for several days. Deputies tracked her down at a home. A very close call here in Brentwood as a massive tree falls, narrowly missing two houses. City crews are busy cleaning it up. And President Trump lashing out on that campaign trail. Why a speech in Texas last night is raising eyebrows tonight. Good evening, I'm Leslie Money. This is KCAL News at 9. We're streaming live on CBS News Los Angeles. We want to get right to breaking news from Santa Ana, where a commercial building is fully engulfed in flames. Take a look there. You're taking a live look from SkyCal, where you can see those flames shooting from the roof of this building. This, we know, is on South Susan Street. We're told firefighters are currently in defensive mode, meaning they're going to surround this building and try to drown it out with as much water as possible. And there could be hazardous materials inside the building. Right now, they're waiting to figure that out as they're just trying to put this fire out. Uh, we do know that power went out in this area, so it does mean some uh, power lines are down there as well. Mm -hmm. Of course, we're looking to get information on what really is inside this building? Was anyone inside at this point? We're not hearing anything mm -hmm. from fire crews on that scene right now, but you are taking a live look at a commercial building mm -hmm. fire in Santa Ana. As we get more right information, here. we will bring it to you. Our other top story tonight, a 13-year-old girl right from Pico Rivera who's been missing since last mm -hmm. Wednesday has been found. KCAL News reporter Laura Posen is live outside Thank Pico you. Rivera Sheriff's Station, Lauren, Thank with you. what investigators I'm are saying tonight. Okay. Mm. Well, Leslie, the teen is back I'm home right safe with her family after Los Angeles County Sheriff's Maybe deputies found her at a home in Montebello around 2 o'clock this mm. afternoon, but there's a lot of questions about how she went missing, Don't. and deputies are Thank not you. 